We have learned in class that we can have experimental tests how light travels. And we said we can have some materials like what what should you have so that we can have a complete experiment? One, yes, we can have candle. Matchbox. We have matchbox. Cardboard. We have cardboards. What else? We have a pipe. What else? Okay, we have cardboards. We can also have something like a nail in order to make holes in between the cardboards and the holes. We said, how how should we make the holes? Yes. The holes should be in the same line. Yes, they should be in the same point to all at at the at the same point in all cardboards. So in our experiment today, we have this is the cardboard and this is the stand. We have the stand so that we can make the cardboards to be in the same alignment. Okay. We have the pipe. This is a straight pipe. And here is another pipe which can bend. Okay? Okay, we have the source of light. That is the candle. That is the candle. That is this is the start of the candle. So we said before we start the experiment, we have to to put them in the same alignment. Where we have the source of heat, we have to group the candles, we have to put them in the same alignment so that we will be in a position to view the light when the candle is lit. So we'll have to arrange them in the same alignment and light the candle so that we can see whether we can have, we can view the light from point. We have the cardboard A, cardboard B, and cardboard C. Cardboard C. So, may I have one people to light this candle? Now we will make the, card, the cardboards in one alignment such that when the eye of the observer is here, he or she can be in a position to see the light from the candle. So after I arrange them, we'll have several people to come and view whether you can have the light, you can be in a position to see the light from the candle by looking at it from this cardboard and all from this hole. So let's have one. Let's start from this boy to view whether you can be in a position to see that light. No. Can you see it? Okay. We have to put the candles in the same alignment. Can you put them, can you check? As you check, position them to be in the same alignment so that you can see that light from the candle. Can you see the light? Yes. Yes. Somebody else? Can you see the candle lighting? Yes. Okay. Somebody else? To view? Yes. Can you see the candle? Yes. Yes. Somebody else? Anybody else? Yes. Come on. View. Can you see it? Yes. Are you seeing the light? Yes. Who else? Mm -hmm. I think everybody should view. Let's give them space. Can you see the light? Yes. Okay. Next. Have you seen it? Have you viewed it? Have you seen it? Yes. Mm -hmm. And after that, we'll conclude one thing from the light. I need everybody to give us the answer. What you can conclude from the, our experiment? Have you seen it? Yes. yes. Have you seen the light? Yes. Yes. Who else? Have you seen the light? Yes. yes. Can you see it? Yes. Yes. 
Now, after, after, uh, does, uh, has everybody viewed to check whether you can see the light from the cattle? Yes? Yes. yes. Now, from, from what you have done here, how, how, what can we learn from our experiment? Everybody? What are we learn from here? You can see everybody is raising up his or her hand. Can we say all together? Light travels in a straight line. Light, light travels in a straight line. Now, what if we change our 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 cardboard B? Remember, we had a uh, we, are, we we had them in the same alignment. What if we change B in a position that it will not be in a straight line? Will we be in a position to see this light from the candle from position C or no. from cardboard C? No. Somebody to confirm whether we can we can see the light from candle from the candle. No, so when when point B is tilted from the alignment of the other candles, we will not be in a position to see the light. Somebody else to confirm whether you can see the light from the candle. You can't see it. So from that one, we have concluded that light travels on a straight line. Yes. So the other experiment will do the same same experiment, but we'll use different different apparatus. What is this? A pipe. Is a straight, straight, straight pipe. And we have another pipe here. Curved, 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 curved pipe. Yes. So we will be we will be in a position to confirm whether light can travel through this pipe to be in a position to see this candle lighting. And also we we'll confirm from pipe B whether we can also see through it to confirm whether we can have the light from the candle. So I'll start by looking at the can whether I can view it from this position, I can see it. When I hold it from this position, I can also see, see it. Let me inform you also to confirm whether you can see the light from that pipe. Can you see it? Yes. What, what about when it's on this position? Confirm. Somebody else? Yes, you can see it to your friend to confirm. You can see it. Can you see it? Yes. Next. Who else can confirm? Can you see? So from this one, that pipe is straight. And through it, we can be in a position to see that candle lighting. What about when you use this pipe, which is bent? Can you be in a position to see it? No. To me, I can't. Somebody else to confirm whether you can see it through this um, pipe. No, I can't see it. You can't see the light? Yeah. Uh -huh. Somebody else? Can you see the light? No. Uh -huh. What? What can we conclude from the two? Yes? Yes, we have concluded that light travels on a straight line, but we can't have light traveling on a curve. Any question? Yes? Any question, please? So from that, you have understood that light travels in a straight line. What if you have an experiment whereby they have, they have, they have decided to, uh, to have the, the apparatus arranged in this manner. Now, we have to know one thing. The cardboard should be of the same size. The hole should be in the same position. And what else? What else should be in the same position? The candle should be in a position where it should be the same alignment with the 
holes, holes from the cardboard for you to be in a position to see everything. So if they bring something, you are asked a question of the arrangement of the apparatus and you'll find them arranged randomly. And then the question is, what, did, what, what was wrong with the setting of the experiment? What is wrong? One? They did not set in the same alignment. Yes, they did not, it was not set in the same alignment. What else? Maybe you get a cardboard where we have the, the, the hole at the center, the other hole up here and the other one down. And you are asked, what is the problem? What, what, what a problem did they make? What mistake did they make? Uh -huh. The holes are not in the straight line. Yes, the holes were not in the straight line. So the holes should be in the same alignment. The cardboard should be of the same size. And if we have the stand, it should be of the same size. And the candle should be also in the same alignment with the, 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 the cardboard. Because if we put this candle at a higher position, like this one, we will not be in a position to see the light. If we have the candle up here, you can have the candle up here, and everything, even if it's arranged in order, in the same alignment, somebody will not be, the viewer will not see the light, simply because it's not in the same alignment with what? The candle. So the candle should be in the same alignment with the cardboard. So, anybody with a question? Anybody with a question? Anybody with a question? Yes? Any question so far? So one thing we have concluded today that light travels in a straight line. Yes, light travels in a straight line. Thank you.